Days for ding, yeah, guys and gals, it's your boy Clutterbutt, and I'm gonna bring you a quick tutorial on how to use your PS4 controller on your PC. You're just gonna come to this website up here, ds4windows.com, hit the download now button, and then you're gonna have these two files right here DS4 Windows and DS4 Updater. Go ahead and click on DS4 Windows, and you're gonna get this screen right here. Enlarge this for you, real quick, and uh, it's gonna be automatically set to the default profile whenever you plug your controller in. As you can see, I just have a uh, regular micro USB adapter plugged into the USB port on my PC and that's what's enabling my controller to work right now. You can also connect via Bluetooth but my computer does not have a Bluetooth adapter. As you can see there's a uh, default profile created. If you go in auto profiles you can add programs and you can actually add them directly from Steam and it'll have all of your games that you have in your uh, library right here on this list. Like you can see I have MapleStory installed, Path of Exile, Dead by Daylight, CSGO, and of course uh, Dark Souls 3, what I actually download this program to play. And when you go to this default profile, double click on it, you can actually change the color of your LED. As you can see I just changed it from red to purple. All you have to do to change the LED color is come right here double click on the default profile edit it or create a new profile and just slide these sliders wherever you want you can make your uh, light bar any color you desire let's get into some uh, Dark Souls 3 and I can show you guys that this uh, actually worked. as you guys can see I'm in the uh, very first basic level and as you can see as I move the left joystick my character is moving around in the uh, beginning level let's test some buttons out for you if I push L1 my shield blocks L2 is a party as if I was pushing left trigger on an Xbox 360 controller. Test out some more buttons for you. Try to attack, do a heavy attack, do some dodging around with circle, hold our sword two-handed, and drink our Estus flask. All the buttons work just like I said in accordance with where they would be on an Xbox 360 controller. As you can see, this prompt is telling me to push A, but if I push X, it's going to accomplish the same thing. Now let's go ahead and try to fight the first boss of the game using the DS4 Windows program on a DualShock 4 PlayStation 4 controller. Ludix Gunder? Keep in mind if I die to this guy I am a Dark Souls 3 virgin and have not played the game before. I am also playing the game blind, as in I have not previously looked up anything on the game to help me further advance. If after this video you would like to see more of my content, I am in the works making a Dark Souls 3 Let's Play series. And I do have all the DLC, so you'll be able to see everything in the game from start to finish. I will also be doing a death counter, so you can see how many times I die by the time I'm done with the game. This guy hits super hard, but he's super slow, so I'm having just like no problems dodge rolling under his swings. That was awfully close. Oh my god, what is that monstrosity coming out of his head? It's like a weird snake tentacle thing made out of darkness or something. I don't think Ludix Gunder is very healthy anymore. Maybe he got corrupted by the darkness that is Dark Souls 3. This is actually my first time actually playing with the uh, DS4 Windows while making this tutorial for you guys. And I must say that DS4 Windows is actually playing very smoothly. It's almost as if I am using an Xbox controller with Windows right now. This has got to be the best controller program, at least that I have used in a very long time. And I am one hit away from a KO right now and just hanging in there. Oh no, this is the end. Oh, fuck. Rest in peace, first time boss fight. Well, why I fight off these guys that respawn, I thank you guys for watching my DS4 and Windows tutorial. And I hope you enjoyed it enough to watch the rest of my content. This is Butter signing out. Peace.